Morning, 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 people. Morning, morning. I'm on in the afternoon. Well, the clock there said 10 25, but afternoon. Is it? Anyway, um, just want to say, um, deepest condolences to, um, I do only on the whole family, you know? Um, condolences to Megan. Royal Entertainment, where I go on, I can wear the. Me lose my mother, right? And when I lose my mother, I cry like. I cry like a cow, like. Me a ball eye water, and nose not, I run out of my nose and him, so. It was horrible. But. Remember, my mother bring me here. So it hurt me bad, but it would have hurt her more if me did drop out while she alive. I can't even start imagine what it feels like to lose a child, is it me? Especially at such a young age, you know what I'm saying? And if not live the full potential of life or not, you know what I'm saying? Then, as far as I know, I make an only child. And as far as I know, I do not own the child. And there's no replacing a child anyway, even if you have more than one. But I mean, like, if you have more than one, you know, you don't, you know, you know. I'm not even as a King Caliph. He always shot me so much now. I never know as a Caliph sick and I don't do him at all. I mean, they must have cancer, me and say. I mean, never hear say, Kelly. Well, them do a good job of keeping the public out of them business where that is concerned, you know? That's nobody never really knows, say. Eh? In secret, I have cancer, you know? But, what more I do one of them do, you know? What more I do and I do is like it's hard for me to tell him to do this, but in the midst of in pain, catch you every negative situation, there's a positive impact or outcome. And you see a faith in God will make you know say, I'll do this feeling so horrible and this thing is so horrible. There is some level of good. You understand where I got derived from it. And once you're strong in your faith in a God, you will allow God to make it play out. And you know what was the blessing surrounding all of this. You know what but me know why it's not rough. Why, where I don't know Megan have to do be ultimately strong for them own sanity. Because them something I will mad you. Them thing I will mad you. So... You know, you have to just stand up in your feet in the Almighty and be strong. Be as strong as possible. Because you have to be strong for yourself. And you have to be strong for your future. You have to know, say, all right, you're still there. And Megan's still there. And the mission not complete yet. Because the mission is complete, you know, they're gone. You know, I mean, so you have to look on the brighter side. God have a place for Khalif in a heaven. He need him now. You understand what I mean, I say? So, when did he just strung up and know, say, yeah, him son a soldier and the Almighty need him right now at this particular moment. You understand what I mean, say? Because God's timing is impeccable, you know. God's timing is never by accident. God's timing is always right at the right time. So the mission might be bigger than what we can see now because we're in a human farm and we're in a human um, domain. So we can't see beyond what's actually happening in front of us, but, you know, we have to just pray and you know, say, him in the bosom of the Almighty, and, you know, him going to help make him parents them stronger, isn't it? Because, as we know, the flesh is temporary, but the soul is everlasting, you get me, answer? It, it, it really... Really, 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 really hurt, star. It really, really hurt. It really, really hurt. But Diddy, just, just strung up here, son. You know what I'm saying? 
No matter where you have to find it from, you have to find the strength and be strong. Megan have to be strong too. Because we see enough people just have posts and did it, did it, did it. We have to post for the two of them. You know, the, the two of them have a strong in union. Imagine how she feel. Imagine how she feel if we feel so empty and we never close to Caliph like that. And my parents, them only child, it's it rough, man. So we have to pray for both of them. We have to pray for strength for both of them. Both Idona and both Megan. You understand? And we have to bless them union and pray for them. So that them can even make a next youth and, you know, try to move forward, even though you can never really move forward, but just the strength to carry on. You see me? Yeah, strong up. No depression, no suicide thoughts, no. I don't want nobody to call the people, I depress them, leave them, give them time. This I want serious something, you see me? I say, no, call them, love the people. Them. If anything, you send a text. Don't try to call them phone right now. Leave them, make them, make them, make them grieve and make them, make them release them, 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 them emotions and everything. Do not call the people them phone. Send texts when them ready. When them ready, them will read the text and answer. You understand me? I say, when them kind of something and people love for call to show so them feel. Sorry, I am hurt. Not you don't need to show that now. Send a text. Do not call the people in for that. Make the people have a moment to release and unleash them hurt and them pain and them emotion. Them don't need nobody to call, call them phone right now, Bridget. You see what I say? Big man thing. Feel away. Rough, it rough. You see now, them I say. Um, Raheem Sterling have to leave World Cup because of family emergency. No, 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 say I'm close to that family there. All right, now me, me head that hurt me because I don't know how I go on. Because if you have to leave World Cup, or something serious. So, that again now have me nervous, like, because he's a, he's a close family friend. And, you know, me don't want to hear nothing about it. You see me? So, I don't know what it is yet, but I pray for him, Sterling, and his family, you know? That's everything all right, you get me? Oh, so much things happening in the world, boy. So much things to say right now. So much things to say. I've got so much things to do right now. So much things to see. Yo, Slick White Line. Me just a sing one Bob Marley this time. Me know why you put it on the Friday for career, the brother. I beg you, please. Me not try to be artist. Me not try to sing a song. Me not just a sing a Bob Marley song. Cause you know, you're dangerous in my head. Me know why you put it on the Friday for career, the brother, please. People, remember say, my badges are work, so when you can donate to the page, when you can do no money pull up on a contribution, because badges, badges are work, right? All right. I'm not going to live and dwell upon the I don't know something too long. Come on, give them a chance to work on themselves. I don't want up on the internet to talk too much about it. We send your condolences. Um, we are praying for, for them to have strength. Deal. We are praying for them to have strength and overcome the emotional turmoil that they might go through of losing their only child to cancer. As you remember, lose my mother to cancer. So, we just a say condolences and love from me and everybody else when we see a post and also, I mean, I say, yeah, when you hear Liquid play that song, the brother, they just do that song there. Actually, I have a song when I do for Marcus Records, 99 Problems, and a girl ain't one. For me, here, I need the amount of girl, I slam. If it's not cook, if it's not roast, I'm not going to 
I eat church and I go pump pump yam. I see me. 99 problems, but a girl ain't one. You see me? That's when the break up, it just go on. I shot that song, a bad song. The lyrics and everything I mean, right? Ask Marcus. You take a list now. Less than 25 minutes or half hour, I write that song there. And vice it and everything. Mm. And put it out to make can go up on YouTube and Google it. And then, I have a next song with me and Egyptian collaboration from the, the rhythm of um, Macadam and of Cold Foot Pan. Bad song with me and Egyptian. And from the right, my verse and, and DJ, I never hear about this song yet. If me tell you now this song go, God come to the ceiling here. Yeah. Me never hear about this song yet. I mean, I remember where the youth name from Portmore. We used to drive with the Lord speak up on him car and advertise people, party and them something. Like him produce the rhythm. What do you mean? I ask Egyptian if him can find him come and need about a song there. Come and remember my verse. Me know say me going now and lyrical content is a girl song. Uh, and the song bad, the studio mash up the day. But I never hear about the song yet. I me need, me need, me need, me need but a song there. Me need but a song there. Remember me have a next song when me say, when me have on left side them rhythm, when them sax on the beach. When me say, me is a boy with touch all kind of girl, bro and slap, bro and girl, slim girl, fat girl, natural. Me is a boy with all kind of girl. I'm a singer and call a bugger girl name and bass it. Well, and I'm my thousand, let me see. I'm my thousand, walk on, big up yourself. Macho kid, yeah! People wanna tag macho kid for me. Tell him he need to hear about my song. I don't know if he put it out, if he not put it out, me put it out. I remember me a record label. Me put it out and share the publishing for me and him. You see me? And Egyptian. But I need my song. I remember my talent in my writing party you now. Uh, uh, in a, in a artist, but, but me just not an artist, me just not born to be an artist. You understand me, I say? But me have me sang them out there. When you can go up on Spotify, and you see Sax on the Beach, produced by Left Side High School, and me have an everybody song for that rhythm there. Then, you can look for Macho Kid rhythm, the rhythm where Cow Foot the Pan, me and Egyptian have that song there. And then Marcus have a rhythm where me have 99 problems, pan. 99 problems and a girl ain't one. You see me? So, I do me look at thing for a long time. I don't really follow it up because I know I'm not born to be an artist. I'm born to play music and administer to people. You understand? And here I know. Nobody now use up the badges. Alright, people, me tell you what I got, what I got with you now. You see, anyway, I go go live and now I get no badges. I'm not going to go live over here now. I'm just going to live over YouTube. Because you know, I don't want content. I don't want to go live. But yet still, other people are cut, cut up my live them and I use them. And I get a check. I mean, I get a check. So if one of the fans not contribute to me going live, and people are just I use my thing and I exploit it, then in a sense. That's why them create badges. You see me? So they can contribute to badges. So that's me, the creator of the content. They can actually make a money. Yes, Pure Bliss 619. Thank you very much for buying badges. So if you don't buy badges and them things, they are waste of time for me to come up on live and they are all there with you know, a chat, chat, chat and only now I throw an offering. You ain't go to church on a true offering. Some of the day I know. DB, big up yourself and buy a one badge. So I don't know the thing go. Alright. Um there's a topic that I really want to speak on. Well, we have multiple topics when we want to speak on. Zin. But this one at the latest rant when we see I go up on social media. People and I remember oh I mean, did have some space yes, sir. You remember? I mean, that was space yes, sir. It gone now. See? Teeth well fixed. Quick and fast. 
I want to have a big old face, so. I want to tell her, so, this face will need braces. Well, I had Invisalign, and you can see, so, Invisalign fix. This face is in no time. Yeah. I work with one place named the Dental Lounge. So if you're in a Fort Lauderdale or Miami and you want to get proper dental care, good with Invisalign, you, you um, link Dental Lounge. Just put in the Dental Lounge. Colombia, no, I'm, in a, I'm a real teeth. You see me? All of them, all of them are real teeth. All of them. Some veneers up here, so. You understand? So, I'm going to speak on a topic, you know, people, and I'm going to give me honest analysis on that topic here. Now, Shensia, I don't know if she use it as a as a blanket to cover over what I go on. Zin. So, she has said, Bob Marley bigger than Michael Jackson. Now, I'm going to give my three cents on that. In idea, some people are going to vex. But, you know, me, I'm going to just start the truth and done. Zin. So, I don't know if she, but she has used it as a blanket or a screen to cover up all of the other dramatics we are going, but it doesn't really matter. She raised a good topic and I think it needs to be discussed. Any one of my celebrity friends them want to join in on the live and give you them three cents on that topic, yeah? Fine. But me, I got to tell you now, my honest facts, because we never say opinion, we are going to facts now. See? So, we know I say Michael Jackson is undoubtedly Michael Jackson is undoubtedly great. One of uh, the world's greatest vocalists slash entertainer. We also know that Bob Marley is one of our greatest vocalists slash entertainer. Right? We know say Michael Jackson leave a great legacy of both music, memories and a and a trust over there. I acknowledge and use that same thing. Bob Marley also left great a great body of music zine well heap of memories and a great trust an estate okay so what you say you don't agree so Bob Marley one of our best vocalists oh yeah say Michael and I one of our best vocalists. What you say? Come and understand what you say. You're not agreeing with me on the vocal part. What you mean? I don't understand. Anyway, now I've got to really pay that no man. So, Yanni, what happened? We are asked what happened to my head for. What's your problem? Hmm? So, anyway. As you say, so what I say is now, Zin, we go so boom, and we're going to analyze the two artists, right? The two artists, them, very dominant in the world. If you ask me, <coughs> Michael and Bob Marley are the most, the two most dominant artists of eternity. See? I'm wrong, I'm right. Bob and Michael are the two most dominant artists of with life. Me would have said that. 
overall in an artist world zine. You know, make a black person, yeah? you come here with a lot of negative, Yanni Boo, or where you want him. Come over here for trace and have a, a negative impact on my life. God go with you. Black you right now. People remember badges still are buy, so and they can buy badges, right? Anyway, what I'm saying is, Fire is 16, I'm glad you joined the live. See? And any, any celebrity where they're on the live, Anybody in a music, me and Limu, that's a selector. Any selector, where they pan the live, I read a personality. We want to join the live after me done, say what me I say. And, um, make we have a talk based on my facts when me I got Japan you now. See? So watch this now. Bob Marley and Michael Jackson are the two most dominant um, me soon add Elisa, me I finish say what me I say first. And then we can add and talk, right? So, <laughs> so, Bob and Michael are the two biggest thing we ever see in our life, right? But we are going to differentiate who bigger than who. See? Shensi has said, Bob, Bigger than Michael. And she upset a whole of people, you know. And a whole of people are clutter, you know. And a whole of people agree with her. And a whole of people disagree with her. So me think it only right. As me, as the viral king, Zin, to give my three cent pan, um, the whole, whole greater situation, right? Eh? Alright. Mega said this plain and straight. If we're gonna talk region, right? Bob are the biggest thing out of our region. Michael are the biggest thing out of the theme region, which is the big old America, right? I'm going to say this. Bob is by far bigger than Michael Jackson. To me, Bob is by far bigger than Michael Jackson to me. Okay? And I'm going to explain. Don't get me wrong. Michael Jackson is one of my favorite. But when we are going to have the talk now, if you say, who bigger, Bob Marley, bigger than Michael Jackson, by one billion mile. See? And it's not because I'm Jamaican why I'm saying that. I am going to explain to you why I say that. Now we are in the era of social media and going viral zin bob never have the help of the internet when baba dominate a letter people are right a letter people are tell i write and when you write a letter it take one month or two months for each zin bob did Uncle have music, music, past Saturday, for sure, and look at two videos of them. Remember, good? Bob never have no big old multi quazillion dollar company a fight for sure. Him. Remember what America did have? America have the big news entity, them, and thing. Member Bob never get no Pepsi endorsement. Member say Bob not get none of the tool them when Michael did have a work for him. Also, remember, Michael had a family structure where they help propel him. 
he was the smallest one as lead singer him after picnic sorry for thing they were work for him you understand michael had so many things going for him that you cannot even compare michael jackson to bob marley little tour you understand it's just the truth bobby deron arita franklin them and be a people diana ross and be a people the want to help bob uh, michael it have bob never have no help You understand me? I say, so there is no way we can even compare Michael to Bob. Bob do this from, from the dirt. Bob never have no family member who in a music. Bob never have no rich family where I help him. Bob never affiliated with no rich virgin. Me know something about Bob. Remember Bob them used to have a fight for going in a studio. You know? Bob them used to have work with them cutlass and them thing there, you know. Gas too there, you know. I'm planning to chop up all the gate, man, you know, if you go inside, you know. Remember, you know, that's why Bob love Alan skill cool, so, you know. Because I'm the good friend with Sirius. Well, once Bob, I said this way, I deal with that in my deal. You know. Even in the afterlife, Bob bigger than Michael Jackson. Even after death. Even after the two of them dead, Bob shows him still. Bob bigger than Elvis Presley, the Beatles, everybody. Bob Marley is the biggest artist of all times. And there's no question about it. Because Michael, to me, is the second biggest artist of all times. Just because how what Bob did have to do to reach the levels here. Bob do it without help. When Chris Blackwell them forward, Bob them done a shot on the place already. And I'll and I'll rub out Kenny Rogers them and I rub out some man. You understand what I say? So it's not even a comparison. You get me I say? For Bob Zin uh, and Michael name even in I see him conversation as who are the greatest. Of all times. Means that Baba the greatest of all times. Flames 876. You know if you agree with me. The truth is there. If you don't want to agree. Your business that. Bob never have where Michael have. So why is Bob being. Marked with Michael. As the greatest. It shouldn't be even. even it shouldn't even be a conversation. And we can prove to you. Bob bigger than Michael. I guarantee you, every party you go back play for the night, whether early or late. Michael no must play. Don't get me wrong, Michael great. Michael have huge songs. Michael have big, 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 giant song. In damn, remember, Michael are one of the quote them. But Bob play more than Michael. Bob more relevant than Michael. Bob can play four o'clock in the morning. Bob can bust it dance at any time. Bob never come off a billboard chart. He done the one, two, or three. I saw Bob thing go. No joke, man. I. Bob are the greatest. Bob sold out stadium with 100,000 people when he never have where Michael have. I work for him. Michael have a whole part thing I work for him. Michael them up on the biggest billboard them in America. The, every highway you go, you see them. Every TV you turn, you see Michael Jackson them. And Bob beat all of that. Bob the biggest thing ever live in a human farm as a music. Somebody say, um, what's your name? Elevate as some mistake. Say, you say Bob did use to have a work with Cutlass about fight for what? You don't know. We are talking about. Get it, daddy? Okay. So this is a person now where you want to be stupid. I'm not even going to disrespect you today, okay? But I'm going to enlighten you. So because you never did it, you don't know the history. Okay, I'm going to speak to you now. Let me tell you how me know. Wally, Bob. Me might know more about Bob.